Welcome to the Hobart High School News. Today is Friday, October 28th. I'm Alex. And I'm Dawson. And here's what's happening in the HHS. Students who qualify for the Work Ready Award should turn in the application to Mrs. Shaw and the Student Services on or before October 31st. Students can also complete the application with the Google form sent from Mr. Rodriguez. Any student who signed up for the work on election day should see Ms. Gill to receive information about the required upcoming training sessions. Students, are you planning on buying this year's yearbook? If so, visit www.yearbookforever.com soon and click on the Buy a Yearbook tab. If you have any questions, see Mrs. Bagone in room 2307. Swimmers, open swim will be held at the middle school 7 p.m. and 9 p.m. on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays unless there's a home swim meet. Students, do you have pictures of yourself and friends that you would like to see posted on the TVs in the Great Hall? Mrs. Hamilton is looking for school-related, school-appropriate photos of students during their normal day at HHS. If you want to see your face on the TV, submit a photo to Mrs. H. You can share them to her at the link below. Now over to Akeen and Jory for some more announcements. Anyone interested in participating in Quiz Bowl, there will be a meeting in Mr. Bromley's room on Tuesday, November 1st. They will hold their first practice until about 4 o'clock. French Club is going to Cafe Fondue on November 1st. Money was due this morning before school. If you haven't turned it in yet, please do so ASAP. Attention Book Club members, all books are now due. Please return last month's book and pick up the new one called Fever if you have not yet done so. A scholarship newsletter from Mrs. Torres has been posted in your Google Classroom. Be sure to read through it and share it with your family. We'll be back with Dawson and Alex for some more announcements right after this short break. Hey, Lisa, Haven't heard from you in a while. Let's go see a movie soon. Hey, it's just your Aunt Deb calling to say congrats on your scholarship, sweetie. You're going to go so far. I'm so proud of you. Hi, this is Dr. Brown's office. We are sorry to inform you that you have in fact torn your ACL. Please give us a call immediately. Hello, this is your pharmacy calling. Your doctor has refused to, perf to refill your prescription. Please contact us. Thank you. Hey, Liz. I hear your pain meds have been cut. I think I can get some pills from my mom's medicine cabinet. Let me know. Hey, kiddo. How you feeling? Your mother says you haven't been yourself. I'll be back in town tomorrow. Let's grab some lunch and talk. You know I love you. I hope you like that little gift I gave you. Let me know when you want another hit. Hey, it's Aunt Kate and family. Happy birthday, dear Lisa. Happy birthday to you. We love you. More than 1,600 teens begin abusing drugs each day. 12 to 17 year olds abuse prescription drugs more than ecstasy, heroin, crack cocaine, and methamphetamines combined. Don't be another statistic. Expected. We never knew he had this problem. I just wish we could have said goodbye. Students, are you missing your Chromebook charger? If so, they're available for purchase in the Media Center for $20. Be sure to purchase one if needed. And don't forget to come into school with your Chromebook charged every day. Are you having trouble finding a job? Target is looking for employees for the holiday season. Benefits include Target merchandise, discount, competitive pay, and flexible scheduling. If you want to make some extra money, stop by a Target store or apply online at www.target.com careers. And that wraps up today's announcements. I'm Alex. And I'm Dawson. Have, Have a great, a great day, day HHS. Yeah.